Dr. Panda. Hello. Dr. Panda. Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda. Let's go. Dr. Panda. Uh-oh. No task too big. Come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires. You always save the day. All the groceries. Hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda. Hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun today. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Hi, everyone. Today, I'm... Wow, you're a helicopter pilot. Ooh. That's right. A helicopter can fly things to places that are difficult to reach. Hey, Dr. P. Whoa, is that your helicopter? Yep, it is. Cool. Can I fly it? I'm sorry, Bip, but I promised to fly these bricks to Hoopa. And after that, I have to take that stack of lumber to Leo. Come on, Bip. We'll miss the bus. We're going for a boat ride on Great Panda Lake. More like a boat adventure. Hello, Dr. Panda? Are you ready with your helicopter? I need more bricks. Over. Hoopa? Yep, I'm coming up now. I have to get to work. Enjoy your adventure. See Bye. ya. Hoopa, I'm hooking the bricks up right now. Okay, Dr. Panda. Over. Clear for takeoff, co-pilot Toto. <laughs> Dr. Panda, where are you? I can hear you, but I can't see you. Whoa! There you are! <gasps> Over. I'll lower the bricks so you can unhook them, Hoopa. Okay. Just put them down right there. Over. Uh, where exactly? Right over there, on the left. Over. <laughs> Your left or my left? Uh, Dr. Panda? I thought there was only one left. Over. Uh, can you point? Just there. Over. Uh, okay. Perfect. Right here. Over. Oh, I'm sorry, Hoopa. Are you okay? Yes, but I meant over there. Oh, I need to keep the helicopter really steady, Toto. <laughs> Thanks, Dr. Panda. Over. Bye, Hoopa. Over and out. Now all we have to do is take the lumber to Leo, and we're done. <laughs> Leo! Well now, Dr. Panda, delivery by helicopter. <laughs> Thank you very much. Are you staying for lunch? Yay! Picnic! Mm -hmm. mm. Isn't it nice to enjoy nature together? It sure is. Hey, look! There's Bip and Mei Mei. Our adventure starts here, Mei Mei. I'll row while you look out for sharks. <laughs> Bip, it's a lake. There are no sharks. <laughs> oh, I know that. Wait, are you sure? Kidding. <laughs> anyway, if a shark comes, I'll just bop it on the nose. Bop, bop, bippity, bop, bop. Whoa! Oops. <gasps> what did you just do? Relax. I've got it. <laughs> Be careful! Stop that! 
Keep calm, Bip. Stay in the middle of the boat. Oh, uh, hey! Whoa! Bip! Help! Shipwreck! No worries! We're gonna save you! Mm. Of course! The helicopter! Come on, Toto! Some helicopter trip? What an adventure, right? Thanks for saving us, Dr. Panda. You know, you should be a lifeguard. <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Bye, Bye Dr. Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. trying to solve a mystery. What mystery? The mystery of the missing Toto. <laughs> Let's see if I can find some clues. <gasps> Look, footprints. I must be on the right track. <laughs> Where could he be? <laughs> there you are. Are you ready to be a detective, Toto? Yeah. Excellent! We'll bring our tablet so we can take photos and make notes. All we need now is a mystery to solve. Moo! Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no! Moo? What's the trouble? Oh, Dr. Pander, something terrible has happened. My carrots have gone missing. Oh, please come quick. No worries, Moo. Toto and I will solve your mystery. I picked my carrots this morning, and now look! Hmm... Why would carrots suddenly disappear? I don't know! Are you sure you haven't eaten them for breakfast? I had eggs for breakfast. Eggs? Hmm... <gasps> Maybe someone <gasps> took them! I don't think so. Who would have taken them? Someone who likes carrots, that's who! Oh, I know! June, she loves carrots. But June wouldn't just take them without asking. 
You know, Moo, sometimes things turn out to be quite different than they seem at first. Anything could have happened. Maybe the baskets have holes. No holes. Has anything else gone missing from the farm? I don't know. I was on my way to collect some apples when I noticed... Oh! <gasps> my apples! Moo! No, not my apples, too! I was going to make my special apple pie! Are you sure there's no thief, Dr. Pander? Not likely. This thief would have to be really tall to reach all the way up there. Olette! She could reach up with her trunk. But Olette is no thief. She would never steal your apples. Nope, well, something else must have happened. So, Moo, when was the last time you saw the apples? Uh, yesterday. Oh, yesterday. Maybe the apples got blown off the tree by a storm. But there wasn't a storm. Okay. Um, oh, maybe you already collected the apples and just forgot? No worries, Moo. We'll solve this mystery together. <laughs> look, look! Oh, what's this? It's a footprint. Well, whose footprint is it? Don't know yet. But I'm sure things aren't as they seem. <gasps> oh, my. Whoever this thief is, they must still be on the farm. First the carrots, then the apples. <gasps> Where else do you keep food? <gasps> the kitchen! Oh, at least my cupcakes are still here. I made them specially. They're my favourite. So, everything's still here then? Oh, <gasps> my cupcakes! No! Oh no, oh no, oh no! All my food gone right from under our very noses! This thief has a big appetite to want so much food. Someone like Hooper. That's ridiculous, Moo. Well, it must have been Bip then. He's fast, and he's certainly a bit of a rascal. Bip does like to mess around, but he's no thief. Sometimes things aren't what they seem at first, remember? Ah, a feather! Another clue! Let's look at what we know. First, there were the empty carrot baskets, then the strange footprints by the orchard, and now a feather in the kitchen. Hmm. No worries, Moo. We'll solve this mystery together. <laughs> Listen in the background. <laughs> we'll solve this mystery together. <laughs> Have you checked the chickens today, Moo? <gasps> My chicken! Oh, no! Oh, no! Someone's taken all my chickens! Remember that things can be very different from what they seem. Maybe the chickens went out for a stroll. I do hope they're all right. Oh, I know! We'll set a trap to find the thief. Ooh. Here's what we'll do. We'll tie the chocolate bar to the camera with string. And we'll get a picture of whoever takes the chocolate. All we have to do is wait. Oh, <gasps> Someone's here. <gasps> They're too quick, Dr. Pander. We'll see about that. Oh, <gasps> Is that my chickens? But why would my chickens want to steal my food? I feed them very well. I don't know. But there must be a good reason. Hmm. Huh? Ah! Moo, look! Oh, my! <laughs> Wow. Oh, my sweet darlings! Thank you! Uh, Moo, I think it's time you enjoyed the special treat the chickens made you. So, there was no thief after all. <laughs> you were right, Dr. Pander. Things can be very different from what they seem. 
Oh, thanks for helping me today. And you too, Toto. Mmm, yummy! Hold it right there, Toto! Hey, that's a very nice picture. You should be a photographer, Dr. Pander. <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. Dr. Panda. Hello. Dr. Panda. Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda. Let's go. Dr. Panda. Uh-oh. No task too big. Come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires. You always save the day. Out of groceries. Hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda. Hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun. Dr. Panda, what are you going to do today? Oh, hey, look at the cool uniform I'm wearing. Can you guess what job I'm doing today? Fire You're a firefighter. Fighter. That's right. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, hey, Toto. <laughs> Fire! That's right, Toto. Firefighters put out fires. But we can also help when someone gets stuck. That's why I bring this axe. Dr. Panda, come down here. Coming, Olette. Ready? Here we go! Woohoo! <laughs> ah, hi, Olette. What's up? Hi, Dr. Panda. It's time for the ladder test. <gasps> we have to make sure it works properly for when there's an emergency. Okay, you get up the ladder and I'll operate the panel. No, you're Chief Ladder Firefighter. I'm Supervisor of Operations. Oh, what does that mean? It means you get up the ladder and I operate it. But you don't know which lever operates what. I'll work it out. Get up there. Okay. Hmm. Let me see. Ah! Ah! No! The green one! Oops, sorry. Ah! Hmm. I wonder what the yellow one is for. <laughs> ah, right. What are you doing? Let me see. <laughs> no, that wasn't it. <laughs> Wait, I got it now. <laughs> oh. Yep, the ladder works perfectly. Oh. We can check that off the list. I feel dizzy. Let's test the siren next. Hello, Hoopa, are you there? Dr. Panda, you have to help me. It's an emergency. I'm stuck. I can hardly see you, Hoopa. Where are you? I'm at home. I'm stuck inside my own house. Please come. Hang on, buddy. We're on our way. But we didn't test the siren yet. We'll do it on the way. Are you coming, Toto? Yay! <laughs> Tell us what happened, Hooper. I was building an extra tower on my house, but I forgot to make a door or any windows. It's really dark in here. No worries. We'll get you out. Hold on, Hoopa. I'm coming. I'll let the ladder. Ready? Ready. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. Wow! A lot! Oh, whoops! Sorry! Hoopa! Are you in there? Hang on, I have a visitor. Come on in! Oh, wait, there's no door. Step back, Hoopa! I have to break the wall with my axe! <laughs> uh, Dr. Panda! Am I glad to see you! Whoa! Cool ladder! Thanks, guys! It was really dark up there. No! Oh, no! Oh, no! 
No? What's the trouble? It's an emergency! No worries! We're on our way! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! no. Oh, What's no! What's the emergency? Oh! Oh! Isabella, one of my chickens. She went all the way up this tree, and now she's afraid to come back down. Have you tried calling for her? Oh. Bella! Uh. Come down! Nope, she can't hear me. Have you tried tempting her down with some food? Oh. Yoo-hoo! Bella! Look what I got here. A basket full of cupcakes. Mm. Ooh, mm. Oh, so good. Mm. That doesn't seem to work either. OK, that's it. We have to chop the tree down. There's no other way. <gasps> Wait, halt, stop. There is another way. Yes, good idea. We can knock the tree over with the truck. Or we could use the ladder. Oh, right. Ready? Uh-huh. Slow and steady now. Hey there, Bella. No need to be afraid. You want to come down with me? Oh, wow. Huh, you don't want to leave, do you? You want to enjoy the view. Papa. Dr. Pander, where's my chicken? She doesn't want to come down. Oh, no. Oh, no. That means this picnic is ruined. Hang on. Is that why you need her down? Yes. I prepared this wonderful picnic for all of us. But we can't eat it while she's up there. Hey, you know, ladders aren't just for getting someone down. They can also take someone up. Hmm? Hi. Mind if we join you? Oh. oh. Come on up, everyone. Wow. What a beautiful sunset. It sure is. Hey, good work on operating that ladder. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Ah, I think that was another job well done, Toto. <laughs> awesome! Yeah, yeah. You know, that ladder was actually a lot of fun. Hey, maybe we can make a ride out of it and start a carnival. What do you think? Yay! Well, that'll be an adventure for another day. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye, Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> wow, that bag looks heavy. Yep, it is. You look like you need some help. Yes, please. What are they for, anyway? They're sandbags. They weigh the basket down so the balloon doesn't fly yeah. away. Phew, thanks. Now we can fly. Yeah! Away we go! What an amazing view. And it's so peaceful up here. Yeah, but can you make it go faster? Oh, uh, not really. If the wind blows harder, we'll go faster. We go where the wind takes us. So, what can you make it do? Well, I can make it go... <laughs> <laughs> Another try, Toto. <laughs> One last bag. <laughs> Why don't you give it one more try? <laughs> you want these? What for? Incredible! I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed it, Bib. Who's next? Moo! Me! Me! Okay, Moo, you can go next. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, my little ones. The sky is no place for chickens. You can have some cupcakes instead. Oh, can I have one too? Flying my balloon has made me hungry. Of course. Come and choose one. I've got raspberry, chocolate, raspberry with chocolate, cinnamon, apple, apple and cinnamon, pear and cinnamon, apple and pear, apple, oh. pear and raspberry. <laughs> apple, pear, cinnamon, walnut and raisins and vanilla. Oh, all your cupcakes look delicious. Yes, and they're very light. They could almost float away by themselves. <laughs> Are you ready for your treats, little darlings? Darlings? Oh, where are my chickens? <gasps> my little chickens! Save them! Huh? Ah, my balloon! Quick, grab the rope! <laughs> oh, no! Uh, no worries, Moo. They're not too high. They'll probably get stuck somewhere and stop soon. Oh! They're going up! Make it stop! I can't! The balloon goes wherever the wind takes it! It's floating away! Quick! Follow that balloon! <laughs> found a way to knock over the cans with the bean bed. <laughs> Yay! <Whoa. gasps> That's it! Hoopa, I need your help. Can you carry my sandbags to the playground? Okay. No, no, big, heavy sandbags. Follow me. <laughs> if we can get these sandbags into the balloon basket, the weight will bring it down. But how will we get them up there? We're going to launch them with the seesaw. Hoopa, jump on this end, please. Okay, here goes. Oh. <gasps> Watch out, darlings! Incoming! Yay! Two. Come on! 
Dr. Pander. Glad to help, Moo. Now, who'd like a cupcake? <laughs> Me, please! <laughs> si -so. Yes, you're right, Toto. Now it's your turn to play on the seesaw. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> ah, this is great. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. <laughs> Bye! everyone. Today, I'm in a museum. Wow! Look! We keep all kinds of objects from a very long time ago and show them to our visitors. Like over here, we have a... Huh? Dr. Panda, have you seen Hoopa? No. He was supposed to bring us the most important piece of our show. The piece that goes here? Exactly. Here's your delivery, guys. What's in here, anyway? It doesn't say on the box. <gasps> a dinosaur. Hmm? But dinosaurs are really big. How would that ever fit inside this box? <gasps> it's broken! No, Hoopa. It's a dinosaur skeleton, and we'll have to assemble it ourselves. Oh. Oh. Well, I can't wait to see it when it's finished. Gotta go. Bye, Hoopa. This must be a leg bone. Or is it the tail? I don't know, but I'm sure there are instructions. Let's empty the box. Hmm, nope. No instructions. This is terrible. We can't just show our visitors a, a pile of bones. Hold on, Richie. Maybe we can put it together ourselves. Without instructions? It doesn't hurt to try. Hmm. Ha! See? Hey! It's like a puzzle! I'm good at puzzles. And this piece must be a claw. Hmm. Only one claw? Ah! There! Uh, I don't think it's supposed to look like that. No? Oh, we're never going to get this right without the instructions. No worries, Richie. I'm sure there's something we can do. Dr. Panda! Dr. Panda! Done! Huh? <laughs> Pencil! Done! Oh, you finished your puzzle, have you? Let me see. Oh, that's a funny horse, Toto. The head is where the tail should be. <laughs> See? Oh, <gasps> that's it! Richie! If we know what the dinosaur looks like, we'll have a much better idea of how to put the skeleton together. But there wasn't a picture on the box. 
We don't even know what this dinosaur is called. Well, we're in a museum. There must be books in the museum library that can help. I'll go get some right away. Hi, Olette. Oh, hello, Dr. Panda. What can I do for you? Do you have a book on dinosaurs? Of course. We have lots. Oh, good. We need your help. It's a dinosaur emergency. Give me all the books on dinosaurs you have, and I'll take them to the main hall. The books aren't allowed to leave this room, I'm afraid. They're very old, and it would be sad if they got lost or damaged. Aw, uh, okay. Hmm. I could use my tablet to send Richie pictures of the dinosaurs. Olette, how many books have you got? Oh. Hello? Dr. Panda, have you found any pictures of dinosaurs? Uh, yep. Quite a lot. Never mind, Dr. Panda. I've put it together. It's a... Giraffosaurus. What about the spiky bit? I thought it was a claw. Uh, it's a spiky knee, Giraffosaurus. I'll just look for a dinosaur with a long neck. Okay. Lots of dinosaurs with a long neck, but none of them have spiky knees. No, no, no. Richie? Dr. Panda, I realized what that spiky bit is. It's a fin. A fin? Yes, like a shark's fin, but for a dinosaur. Oh, okay. I'll look for a picture that looks like this. Lots of swimming dinosaurs with a long neck, but none of them have a tiny shark fin. Dr. Panda, I've got it now. See, I made a mistake. The neck bones were actually tail bones. It's a T-Rex. <gasps> so where does the spiky bone go? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, maybe it's a tooth. <laughs> There! Oh, all done! <laughs> Hoopa, have you found the instructions? Better than that, Richie. I was driving my truck, and I heard a rattling sound. And then I looked, and I found... more bones! Ah! No! I told everyone about the dinosaur. They can't wait to see it. Have fun putting it together. Bye! Bad, bad. Oh, Dr. Panda, we'll never get this right. Don't give up, Richie. I'll keep looking in these books. Hmm. Now, what is that spiky bone? Oh, that's it! We'll never know what this dinosaur is called. No, Richie! Look! <gasps> That spiky bone is its nose! What's it called? Welcome, everyone, to the unveiling of our new Centrosaurus! Whoa. Oh, yes! Whoa. A Centrosaurus! Whoa, it's awesome! That's impressive! It sure is! Wow! What an amazing animal! Have you finished your puzzle yet, Toto? <laughs> horsey! Horsey! Aw, you want to play horsey, huh? Well, that's an adventure for another day. Bye, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. Dr. Panda, hello. Dr. Panda, Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda, let's go. Dr. Panda, uh oh. Task to big, come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires, you always save the day. Out of groceries, hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda, Dr. Panda, hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun.
Panda, Panda. What, what are you, you going, going to, to do today? today? Hi, everyone. Today, I'm going to babysit <laughs> Moose chickens. Aww. <laughs> 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 everything's all right. It's the perfect time to get lucky with you. Hey, Moo, that's a nice song. Oh, <laughs> hello, Dr. Panda. I didn't see you there. <laughs> I get a bit carried away sometimes. <laughs> Well, you sounded great. And something smells great, too. Oh, yes! I've made you some cupcakes! As a thank you for looking after my little darlings tonight. Mm, thanks! Oh, I'm so excited to see my favourite band in concert. We're getting clucky tonight and everything is all right. It's the perfect time to get clucky with you. <laughs> <laughs> Your chickens seem to like the music, too. Oh, yes! But a concert is no place for chickens. Aww. And neither is the kitchen. Out you go! These Aww. cupcakes are for Dr. Panda. <laughs> oh, you know I don't mind sharing. That's very kind, but they can't have food before bed. It keeps them awake. If they eat any of those cupcakes now, you'll have awful trouble getting them to sleep. Once you've read them a bedtime story, they go into their chicken coop to get cosy for the night. Oh, and make sure all five of them are inside. No worries, Moo. I've got it. Be good for Dr. Pander now, won't you? <laughs> we'll be fine. Have a great time at the concert, Moo. Oh, I will. We're getting clucky tonight. And everything is... Oh, remember, don't give him any food. It's time to get clucky with you. And that's how the brave little fairy saved the big giant. Ah, <sighs> Right, chickens? Time for bed. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Good night, chickens. Sleep well. Ah, chicken sitting is easy. They're so well behaved. Ooh, I think I'll have a cupcake. Toto, would you like a cupcake? <laughs> <laughs> I'll save one for him. Huh? <gasps> Hey! Chickens! <laughs> Stop that at once! Off you go! Back to bed now. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. What's going on? Ah! Now there are none! Oh, so that's how they got out. Hello? Hoopa, I need your help at Moose Farm. Sure thing, Dr. Panda. I'll be right there. <laughs> Great job. Thanks, Hoopa. No problem. Easy fix. Now all I have to do is get the chickens back inside. <laughs> Let me help you. It'll be easier with the two of us. Oh, great idea, Hoopa. Why don't you catch those two and I'll go after the one inside the house. Sure thing. Here we go. Chickens back to bed, and Moo will be home soon. 
Maybe we can tempt them in with food. They've already eaten. That's the whole problem. Mm. If only there was something else they liked. Oh, <gasps> That's it! Hoopa, you're a genius! I am? We're getting clucky tonight, and everything is all right. It's the perfect time to get clucky with you. Join in, Hoopa, <laughs> tonight, and everything is all right. It's the perfect time to get clucky with you. That's it, Hoopa! Tonight, and everything is all right. It's the perfect time to get clucky with you. Perfect! Yay! Great singing, Dr. Panda! And you! <laughs> oh, I'm tired. But time for me, too. Thanks for all your help, Hoopa. You're a great pal. Anytime. Bye. Phew! We're getting clucky tonight, and everything is all right. Hello, Dr. Panda! Oh, are my little darlings fast asleep? Oh, they're certainly fast, and hopefully they're asleep. That concert was amazing. I think I'm going to become a pop star. You should. Your singing is very good. Oh, but then who'd look after my farm? <gasps> Perhaps you could be a farmer for me, Dr. Panda, since you're so good at looking after my chickens. Uh, <laughs> maybe that's an adventure for another day. <laughs> See you next time. Goodbye, Dr. Panda. <laughs> bye bye. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda, what are you going to do today? Oh, hi, everyone. Well, I'm surrounded by books. Can you guess where I am? <laughs> You're in a library. Yep. Today, I'm taking in and lending out books. That's the cool thing about libraries. We all share. <laughs> hi, Toto. Have you found something you like? <laughs> Story. Okay. Nobody needs my help right now. Shall I read this to you? Yay! Here we go. <clears throat> in a small house in a big city lives a boy whose mom and dad are so poor they can hardly afford food. <gasps> One day, the boy finds a map to a secret treasure. <laughs> It's buried where an X marks the spot, in a deep, dark forest in a strange land filled with mysterious creatures. To get there, our hero has to find a way to cross a wide river. <coughs> Sorry to bother you, Dr. Pander, but can I take this book out, please? Ah, sure, Moo. I found this book with new cake recipes. I can't wait to try them. Mm. Oh, they look delicious. If the cakes turn out nicely, I might bring some for you later. That'd be awesome. Happy baking, Moo. Thank you. Enjoy your story, Toto. Okay, let's find out how our hero is... Huh? What? Where's our book gone? Story? Mm, do you want to find another one? Story? Mm, maybe... Oh! Maybe 
our hero finds a boat to cross the river. <laughs> the river is fast and wild, and our little hero has to hang on tight. <laughs> Look out for that rock! <laughs> Phew! Safely on dry land! Now, the little hero is in a strange land. Who knows what creatures he may encounter? Ahem! <clears throat> I've been waiting for help for quite a while now. Oh, Olette! Hi! Uh-oh! Uh a grumpy ogre! What? The ogre stands between our hero and his quest for the treasure. Oh, uh, yes, uh, I'm a big scary ogre. <coughs> Who dares set foot on my land? Oh no! Will the ogre make the hero into soup and gobble him up? I'd prefer a fruit salad. Our brave hero isn't scared. He says, why don't we look for the treasure together and share it? Hmm. Very well. This way. <laughs> oh, no. There are huge boulders blocking our hero's path. Good thing the ogre is strong enough to clear them out of the way. <laughs> upon a ginormous, snoring troll. If the troll wakes up, he'll demand we pay him to go through his forest. <laughs> Oops. What do you want? Our hero is on a quest for treasure, but he's lost his map. Ah. Well, uh, to pass through here, you'll have to pay me. Oh. Uh, the hero has no money, but if you will help find the treasure, you too can take a share. Uh. Okay, I'm in. They go deeper and deeper toward the heart of the dark forest. So, how do we find the treasure? Uh, the treasure is buried where an X marks the spot. <gasps> Up there! Must be around here somewhere. <gasps> X. Oh, hi there, Toto. Look, my cake's turned out lovely. <laughs> treasure, treasure. Huh? Our hero has found. Treasure! His quest is over. <laughs> There's enough for everyone. <laughs> His poor family will never go hungry again. The troll and the ogre have definitely earned their share of the treasure. And so has the storyteller. That was fun. But I wonder what happened to the real storybook. Uh... Sorry, uh, I wanted to read it, so I took it. <laughs> it was kind of boring anyway. I fell asleep. Your story was so much better. Oh, maybe you ought to be a writer, Dr. Pander. <laughs> I think that's an adventure for another day. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Pander. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> Bye.
Dr. Panda. Hello. Dr. Panda. Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda. Let's go. Dr. Panda. Uh oh. No task too big. Come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires. You always save the day. Out of groceries. Hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda. Hello. Come on, let's go. Dr. Panda, what are you going to do today? Hi, everyone. Today, I'm going to help out on Moo's farm. We'll be planting seeds to grow vegetables. Will you get muddy? That's right. I'll probably get messy, so I'm wearing my overalls. Dr. Panda, play! <laughs> you can play on Moo's farm, Toto. Let's go. Yay! Thanks for coming, Dr. Panda. Look, I've already prepared the field. Great! All you need to do is plant the seeds that are in this sack. I have to go out and deliver some vegetables. Can you manage without me? No worries. I'll get to work right away. Play! <laughs> I'm afraid that bowl's no good, Toto. There's a hole in it. Oh! Gosh, that barn is full of old junk. One of these days, I'll sort through it. Well, see you later, Dr. Panda. Bye, Moo. Come on, Toto. Look, Toto. These are the seeds. We plant them in the ground, and in time, they grow into vegetables that we can eat. Yay! <laughs> Birds! Oh, oh no! Shoo! Shoo! Stop eating the seeds! <laughs> shoo! Shoo! Uh, now I'll have to plant this row again. if the birds are just waiting to come back. Maybe there's something in Moo's barn that we can use to keep the birds away. Uh, let's see. Ah. Whoops. Hmm. This gives me an idea. Toto, I've made a scarecrow. <laughs> Hopefully, it'll fool the birds into thinking there's someone here. You reckon it'll work? Shoo, shoo, birds! Shoo! Oh, oh, they're more scared of me than the scarecrow. Hey, maybe I can make it look more like me. Those are 
Pirates are scared when I move around. Maybe they're not scared of the Scarecrow because it stays still. to the seeds before Moo gets back. Done, ha, with some seeds left over. What are those birds up to now? Oh, I think I've scared the birds a little too much. Maybe there's something we can do for them. just as the seeds will grow into food for us. Great work, Dr. Panda! Oh, hi, Moo! Huh? You've planted all these seeds so quickly. Was it hard work? Oh, let me get you a glass of lemonade. Oh, well, I'm glad you're excited, but it's no trouble. <laughs> Moo, that's not me. I'm over here. Huh? Oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> well, perhaps I need my eyes tested. Maybe that's something you can help me with, Dr. Panda. <laughs> I think that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>